Hey guys, here we are on lesson six in module three, video number one. And you see we have a problem here on the screen. 132 inches is equal to how many feet? Obviously in lesson six, we are continuing working on converting among units within the customary measurement system to solve problems and working on fractions and whole numbers as well. So what do you notice here? Yes, we are looking at 132 inches and trying to find out how many feet that is. And also, when we've been working on this in lesson five, um, we did not go from inches to feet. We always went from something larger to something smaller. So now we're going from something smaller to something larger. So how do you think we're going to do that? Well, today we're going to convert a smaller measurement unit into a larger measurement unit, and that's what we'll be working on. All right, here we go. Look at that. There is a tape diagram of 132 inches equaling feet. Sorry, just trying to make it a little bit bigger for us there. Doesn't want to do it. There we go. Okay, so... Um, in our tape diagram, we have one foot, right? One foot and one inch. So what does the tape diagram show us about the relationship between one foot and one inch? A foot is longer than an inch, definitely. A foot is 12 times as long as one inch, because you can see here's one inch and there's 12 of them, right? So it's in your reference sheet on page 41 from lesson five that one foot is equal to 12 inches, okay? Let's continue thinking about that. 12 inches in a foot, we can see that there. What fraction of a foot is equal to one inch? What fraction of a foot is equal to one inch. So one inch, and you can see it right here, one inch, right? One inch is one out of 12 parts of a foot. Is that true? One inch is equal to one twelfth of a foot. Make sure you're writing these notes down somewhere because I do expect you to be taking notes during the video. Okay, find a blank page, get a piece of paper, be able to show me when I ask you um, during your must-dos. Okay, so one inch is equal to one twelfth of a foot. Hmm. Also, 12 inches is equal to one foot. So what do we notice about these two equations here? They're showing equal lengths. Yes. I should have it switched around though so that we have, um, right? This should be here. Let's fix that really quick. Why am I fixing it? Uh, is it going to erase? Okay, I'll just rewrite it down here. One foot is equal to 12 inches. Now, why did I want to switch that around? I wanted to switch that around because I want to show my one foot and my 12 inches. My 12 inches and my one foot. Yeah, they're the same but my one twelfth and my one inch, right? The 12 inches is equal to one foot. That's talking about this, but my one inch and one twelfth is just talking about this part right here. Okay, good enough. In each equation, we can see that the number of feet is one twelfth the number of inches. Yes, okay. What is true about the number of feet equal to 132 inches? 
coming back to our problem there on the screen. The number of feet is one twelfth as much as the number of inches. So the number of feet is going to be one twelfth as much as the number of inches. Because the number of feet is one twelfth as much as the number of inches, is the number of feet greater or less than the number of inches? It's going to be one twelfth as much. The number is going to be smaller, right? Okay, less than the number of inches because one twelfth is less than one whole, right? Why does it make sense that a smaller number of feet is the same amount as a larger number of inches? Think back to hours and seconds, right? Seconds are smaller, so the number is going to be larger. All right, so 132, we're going to expand this out a little bit, okay? So we're just going to rewrite it 132 times 1 inch, all right? That is still exactly the same as 132 inches. 132 times 1 inch, okay? And that is the same as 132 times 1 12th of a foot. Now, do you notice what I did there? Right? I substituted. Very good. So, my one inch is equal to one twelfth of a foot, right? We have that right here. One inch is equal to one twelfth of a foot. So 132 times one twelfth of a foot is going to tell me how many feet is 132 inches, right? Okay, so now that I have this written, I can... Remember that this is also a whole number, so I'm just going to multiply those two together. 132 over 12. And now I know that I'm going to have to do 132 divided by 12 to find the answer because 132 twelfths is a division problem, right? 12 goes into 13 one time. 1 times 12 is 12. 1 left over. Bring down the 2. 12 goes into 12 one time. 1 times 12 is 12. And I zeroed it out. So 132 inches is equal to 11 feet. 11 feet. How about that? Hmm. How is converting inches to feet similar to converting inches feet to inches we're still going to multiply right but if i was going from feet to inches i'd be multiplying by 12 right one foot times 12 would be 12 inches but when i go from inches to feet i'm multiplying by 1 12th because each inch is 1 12th okay awesome job we can multiply by a fraction, or we can divide, right? 132 divided by 12. All right, thank you very much for your kind attention. I will see you in the next video. Aloha.